and welcome to Discovery Hub, brought to you by the Athletic Children's Department. My name is Shakira, and today we'll be making a DIY lava lamp. Now, what is a lava lamp? It's a decorative lamp made of a colored wax mixture and a clear liquid trapped inside of a glass vessel. At the bottom of the vessel, there's a light, and when the light heats up, it causes the wax to move. But how does the wax move? It loses its density and warms up. When it warms up, it goes to the top, where it cools down and comes to back to the bottom and the cycle repeats. Now, the lava lamp we're making is a little different than that, but that's okay. You'll need some household items consisting of a glass jar or a bottle, some water, some vegetable oil, any food coloring of your choice, and fizzy tablets. Now, if you don't have fizzy tablets, you can also use table salt. And to add an extra flair to it, you can use glitter. Now, the first step is to add about a fourth of water into the jar. And then you'll add your vegetable oil the rest of the way. Now you'll add the food coloring as much as you want. And I'm gonna add some glitter. All right. And we're gonna let the food coloring settle at the bottom into the water. And after that, we'll add our tablets and break it up so that you have more to refill. Once it's all settled at the bottom, you drop your tablet in and watch as it rises to the top. What makes a DIY lava lamp? This is with the help of polarity and density. Density is when one substance is heavier than, than another. Water is heavier than oil, so it sinks to the bottom. What causes wa water and oil not to mix is polarity. Polarity means one substance has a charge different from another. Water has two different charges, positive and a negative charge, while oil has no charge whatsoever, which keeps it from mixing. The fizzy tablet has what you call sodium bicarbonate. The tablet itself is denser than both the oil and the water, so it sinks all the way to the bottom. Once it touches the water, it starts to dissolve. Once it dissolves, carbon dioxide bubbles start to rise to the top. It catches and latches onto some of the water and brings it to the top with it where it pops. Another cool thing to do, you can turn off the lights, uh, put a flashlight at the bottom and watch it as it glows. Thank you guys so much for joining me for a Discovery Hub today. I hope you had fun and we'll see you next time. Bye! Inspirational. Exceptional. High tech. Organizing. Huh? Suspenseful. Reading is musical. Out of this world. Reading is everything. The song. Reading. Shout. We're open. Check us out.